so i am going to tell you the introduction of camera camera is basically a molecule editor which will we further use information mechanism drawing and further we can use for to find the resonance to find the analysis and so we can uh, further by camera we can draw the structure by name we can draw name by structure we can further find the nmr simulation we can find mass spectrum simulation we can draw chromatography uh, plates by which we can find rf value we can draw uh, there are uh, several templates available in camera which i will further tell you uh, next i will tell all the functions of the tools of camera on the right left side you are watching several tools of camera so i will tell the function of all these tools one by one so first tool is marquee so marquee is used to select a structure or a particular many structures rectangularly or in a regular way next is lasso lasso also has the same function as that of marquee but it is a used uh, it is uh, to select a structure randomly not regularly not in a rectangular or in a uh, square for a way next is fragmentation tool so uh, by the name it is uh, shown that it is showing that it is used to fragment a particular structure or a molecule attached on outside of the membrane so after the fragmentation you can see that uh, not all the its carbons and hydrogens are fragmented in uh, also its exact mass is fragmented into two equal parts next is structure perspective so this is a used to show the three dimensionality of a particular structure next is eraser as the name eraser is showing that it is used to erase any particular uh, th uh, structure or bond which you think that is not properly done like you can use the eraser to convert the this double bond into single bond the, in this way uh, next is solid bond solid bond is used to uh, you apply solid bond on a structure or in a molecule like if you have to apply the solid bond and you have to click on the this carbon and click on it so in this way further if you want to change the bond angle to show the steric hindrance you can change the bond line, bond angle in this way next is text uh, text tool text tool is used to write the text on the particular structure in this way now by text tool i have converted this benzene into pdd next is next is multiple bonds so it is used to draw many multi several multiple bonds like you can watch that there are many several bonds this is double bond this is one bond and one uh, simple bond and there are many other bonds so these are uh, used to in the structure next is pen tool so pen tool is also used to draw the structure it is used to draw any sort of bond or distinction next is dash bond and you are watching several other bonds hashed bond uh, hashed wedged bond bold bond wedged bond and hollow wedged bond so and, and the last is wavy bond so all these bonds are used to show the stereochemistry of a structure like if you have, if we have to apply this bond on the benzene on the stereo uh, center we will do it. we will have to apply on it at the stereo center if we have to apply this solid bond you know that is used to show that the fo the following uh, group is moving is towards you and this is used to show it is away from you so next is these are bonds are used for this purpose uh, next is arrow tool so arrow tools we use arrows in chemistry for several purposes like it is used to show the draw the equation this arrow and next there are many arrows it, these are used while drawing the mechanism to show the transfer of electron from one species to another species 
further we have uh, this arrow to show the equilibrium and there is uh, another arrow this arrow is uh, used to show the resonance okay so next is orbital tool so there are many orbitals in this uh, which you are you can use so we can apply this or in this way on that particular carbon in this way further we can and next is drawing tool so drawing tool is further have many other structures these are used to uh, circle the structure or square the structure or, or box the structure next is backer tool backer tool is uh, used to back any particular situation you think that is important next is chemical symbols there are many chemical symbols this is plus this is minus and uh, it is used to show the carbocations which have if they have deficiencies we use plus if they have excess of electron next species we use minus and these are further this is electron pair this is lone pair there are several other chemical species symbols next is query tools so these are also used in the cam drive will further tell if it is possible so next is advanced tool so advanced tool it is uh, used to draw the boxes and uh, the further next is it is chromatography it is used to tell they if there we have several species these are the like we have to compare several TLC plates so we use this technique it is used for the to find the R value in the chromatography next is DNA sequence we know that DNA uh, follow special kind of sequence we use this are glycine alanine we know that they are nitrogen space with the specific sequence we use this tool for this purpose uh, next is template there are several templates available which we can further modify in a particular next structure there are uh, slides present of amino acids aromatics you are watching there several so we can it, uh, we know that if we draw these structures manually it takes a uh, little much time so we use uh, we can draw this by this by cycles and you are watching that and uh, clip where part one conformers you know that there are several conformers we can uh, then play uh, right uh, the name of a molecule which you want to put at this place and there are several other uh, so super molecules stereo centers you can also write it RNA templates and polypeptides and several others you can use which you can use while you are using there are many others like hexoses if you are uh, if you are studying uh, stays if you are studying uh, biochemistry so you can use this way you can change the bond from one position to another position I will tell you it further so next is chain structure so it is used to draw the chain your chain form of, of bond so it is pentane cyclopentane heptane octane nonane and decane so next is these there are at then there are several structures these are like it is cyclobutane this is cyclopropane and this is cyclohexane so these are the structures are available cyclopentane so these are the structures available so we can easily write uh, because they are used in several purposes this is another structure this is chest cyclohexane if you have studied the stereochemistry you can easily understand it there is a chair cyclohexane it is benzene now it is benzene and it is cyclopentadiene so so this is the way you can use all these tools i will further tell you in the video how we can further use these tools for our further uh, for drawing the structure of a molecule for drawing the mechanism and many other purposes 
सो नेक्स्ट आई विल टेल यू हाउ वी कैन फाइंड हाउ वी कैन ड्रा स्ट्रक्चर मैनुअली एज वेल एज ऑटोमेटिकली लेट से वी हैव टू ड्रा द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एनी पर्टिकुलर वी हैव टू ड्रा फर्दर बॉन्ड सो इफ वी वॉन्ट टू ड्रा द बॉन्ड वी विल हैव टू क्लिक ऑन द टिप ऑफ डैट पर्टिकुलर बॉन्ड दिस वे इफ वी वॉन्ट दिस वे we don't have to click from that position or that position we have to click right on the tip of the bond and further if we want to uh, add uh, any uh, any group there any atom there so i will cl- uh, again click on the tip of that car that bond so in this way if i have to add carbon there so in this way so uh, in this way we can do it so these are uh, manually ways like we can further draw uh, in the next in the video i will tell you how we can manually draw mechanism resonance and other structures uh, let's say we have to draw the structure of al- alanine so what we will do we will draw single bond and then we will we will click on that single bond it will be become double bond and then we will have to draw another bond so i will click on the tip of these two bonds and if i have to draw another bond and i have to draw an other bond so i will click on that one i have to apply wedge bond i will click on the tip note at this position at this position so i have to add by have to add uh, uh, atom there there uh, oh and there uh, nh2 and there ch3 so in this way this is uh, uh, the structure of l alanine which i have drawn manually if i want to draw the structure of l alanine automatically so i will go on the structure and then i will convert name to structure then there i will uh, write the l l so there is a structure it is uh, seems different from the structure which i have drawn manually because it is according to the algorithm of camera so if we want to know the another structure let's say we have a name paracetamol i don't know i know the name of paracetamol but i don't know how what is its structure so i will write para ceta mol so this is the structure of paracetamol but i have drawn it and so you can further draw bromo benzene nitro benzene and further many structures manually but uh, if uh, you are uh, you watching that uh, i have a structure of diazepam palm diazepam so the cam draw is showing that it can know to find the structure so we will Uh, get it by another way i will i will show you so to draw the structure of diazepam i will go on the uh, google and write diazepam and there is diazepam so i will go on the wikipedia and there so from there i will uh, go for you are watching smiles so i will copy that smiles and then then i will a paste special there i will paste smiles so this is the structure of diazepam which can not be generated by camera but can be generated by a smiles way so there are many other ways of our structure which we which we, which we can draw by camera but by name as structure by in as in chl so in, by these ways we can draw the structure and then we can further draw the mechanism and many other ways hope you have got the point further uh, i will tell you how to find the stereochemistry of a particular structure stereochemistry means rs or easy notation so uh, 
before going towards the uh, studio chemistry let us first draw a particular structure okay so we have a particular structure l alanine l alanine is a one of one of the amino acids you know that there are 20 amino acids present in the human body uh, out of which one is uh, l alanine uh, which is uh, actually uh, have one carboxylic group and one nh two group and which are further attached to uh, ch3 group okay so this is the structure of l alanine so before uh, trying its uh, stereo combining its copy i will show you how to find its stereochemistry how to change its rotation okay so in this way we have two uh, l alanine structures and by using the uh, drawing tool i will further draw a dashed line after drawing its copy i will show you how to find its stereochemistry how to change its rotation okay so in this way we have two uh, l alanine structures and by using the uh, drawing tool i will further draw a dashed line among these okay. so if i have to find the stereochemistry of this particular molecule though i will take this carbon as a stereo center and then i will click on this option show stereo chemistry so it is showing that it is s in an shimmer uh, and if i have to change this particular uh, you know it's a uh, stereo chemistry it will also be s so if i have to change this s in an shimmer into r in an shimmer uh, what will i do i will click on the uh, object and i will flip it horizontally shift control h so then i will if i then i will find if i, I will find its stereo chemistry you will see that its stereo chemistry will be r so this is how we can find the r s so notation of a particular uh, of a particular molecule so further if we find if we want to find the easy notation of a particular molecule let's say we have this so we have a particular molecule and which have further we will have another molecule uh, this way so there are two molecules which have uh, different notations in different ways so i will tell you how to find the a z notation of it will be same. so if i have to find the r z notation of this particular then what will i do i will click on this and uh, and click on the show the stereo chemistry so it's a uh, stereo chemistry is e so if i have to find the stereo chemistry of this it is z so it's a top priority group are on the opposite sides of the double bond that's why it is e and if uh, opposite bonds are uh, high priority structures are on the same side that's why it is z in n shimmer this is how we can find the stereo chemistry for any particular structure next uh, i will tell you how to draw resonance structures and how to draw uh, the mechanism diagram mechanism so let's start with the resonance uh, let's say we have a resonance hybrid of bromium ion. There we have a benzene. Okay, so it is there is a bromine attached on it. So we first we have to convert this double bond into single bond in this way and then we will use one sulfur positive so 
to show it a uh, resonance so if we further want to progress it we will just copy it and and then bring it in that that way so what will we use we will further use it so in this way it is what it is showing it is showing that the this electron density is moving in this position and uh, so structure let's say uh, i will use erase it and uh, what i will do i will put this positive there and i will further i will a single bond there so in this way if we further want like in this way we can uh, we just need to copy this particular benzene hybrid so we have to use uh, arrow to show that how it is further processed this electron density is transferred to this position and uh, now we will use a laser to further do the next process there we plus and we use single bond there so in this way we uh, i have shown you how we can draw resonance hybrid now next uh, how we can draw the mechanism i will tell you further uh, yeah, have reaction with water and it will further form h3o positive and one of its intermediate structure in this way then I will tell you how we will use this equilibrium arrow okay so further we will have the formation of A3O positive H3O positive so in this way we further want to convert this into formula we can apply this formula so in this way we have but but further one thing is left is we have to show it intermediate after I have put negative on it you will see that this hydrogen disappear to to show the valency stability to show that this is a survey of so in this way we can show the uh, mechanism we can show the equilibrium state next uh, next I will show you how to draw the mechanism from the benzene from any other species let's say we have benzene i will convert this benzene into bromo benzene so the stages of mechanism let's say we have it will be further further we have uh, 
okay so what will happen the bur- bur- the electron density of benzene will attack on this bromium cation so we now there will be the so further there will be the attachment of of this bromine on on it and further there will be the deficiency of one get uh, one electron pair which so further what will happen before going further I, I just I need to copy and paste this okay so what uh, I have to now I have to use resonance arrow to further proceed in the following way now I have now we have this uh, electron density which will attack on the part which have deficiency of electron density so in this way there we have another error to show the resonance hybrid and what we will further do we further uh, proceed that this electron density will move towards this position uh, in this way now we have this I will use the so we have their positive ion and then we will have the single electron so further what we have to do is we will have uh, to further shift this uh, electron density unless and until the benzene regain its aromaticity so what we will have we have the we will have to copy it and paste it to so then what will happen there will be the there will be the the transfer of this electron density to this position now what we will have now we will have so there will be we have positive and there we will have one of the hydrogen so what will happen this hydrogen will so there this hydrogen will attack on this position and then we will uh, have the regain of aromaticity So in this way I have converted this benzene into bromo benzene to bromo benzene. In this way now I will use eraser to erase the things which are so in this way I have completed the mechanism and I have converted this uh, this benzene into bromobenzene. Hope you
you have uh, understand each and every point so we all know that uh, there are long chain structures like uh, uh, i am going to drop steric acid and we have to draw each of the carbon present on this chain so how it will, if you start one by one it will be very exhausting very time taking so how we will we will draw one of the it and then we will do we will copy it and then in this way so in this way we can level so in this way we can level all the carbons in less time So next tip is how we can align this structure as you are watching that uh, they are not equally they are not uh, equally drawn they are not equally aligned so how we can align it we will first select the both structures with the arrow and then we will use object and use align and will align and then we will use top bottom center so in this way you are watching that both these structures as well as this arrow has aligned next step is we want to add uh, any sort of catalyst to this structure how we will do it we will simply after dying we will use this molecule structure formula to show to convert it into formula so in this way further if we want to add uh, pressure or temperature we will use 200 and uh, we now that we want to add it so how we will use we will go to the view and we will use character map window so there we can use degree centigrade and we can use in this way and further if we want to add pressure like 1000 ATM so there we can use we can also use if we want to use delta there so we can use delta there or any other symbol beta alpha or any other symbol there in this way uh, next is uh, to find the mass and formula of this particular structure i have drawn it I, and i know its formula and molecular mass but uh, how we can, uh, i can automatically check it so i will click on the view and then i will click on the show analysis window so in this way you are watching that its formula is showing and then exact mass is showing molecular mass and further uh, it is also showing its look okay. and if we want so not want this carbon hydrogen so we can so in this way we can use paste it and we can paste it behind it so in this way we can find both the molecular mass and formula automatically the next tip is we want to find the nmr prediction of this particular structure so we will use structure and then this is nmr shift this is so we can use this to show the yeah, yes so you are watching that this is the nmr prediction of you are watching that so in this way you can find shifts this is the complete report of M nmr 
so this is how you can find you will click on the structure and then you have to use any option to go for it that's the end of this video i think you have got all the points so don't forget to like this video also comment in the comment section and uh, subscribe the channel and also click the bell icon for more videos related to camera